Hi everyone, welcome to Adventures with Jenny. Today we are on a... Hi everyone, welcome to Adventures with Jenny. Today we are on a fun fall adventure. We are in Cross Village at the Tunnel of Trees. We are at the top of the Tunnel of Trees. We drove over from Mackinac City. If you didn't watch that vlog, I will have that link down below, our trip to Mackinac Island. But we are heading down the Tunnel of Trees. We cut over so we would be at the top of the Tunnel of Trees where Legs Inn is at. If you are familiar with that Polish restaurant, it is super famous. And we were going to eat lunch there. But I had a feeling that it was going to be really busy. And it looks busy from the outside. So we're going to skip that this trip. And there is also the Batasky Brewery right across from Legs Inn. My mom and I did that on our last trip here last year. And so that is also a great spot for eats and beer. And my mom and dad just went into Three Pine Studio to get a glass pumpkin. We came here last year, and I got a little pumpkin, and my mom did, and she wanted to get one this trip. And Franklin just fell asleep, so we are just going to stay back in the car before driving down the tunnel of trees. It is kind of a rainy Michigan chilly fall day, but the colors look really nice, and so I'll record as much as I can of the Tunnel of Trees. What's bad about the Tunnel of Trees is that there isn't a lot of spots to pull over to take videos and photos. The road is really narrow. It almost looks like it's a one-way road, but no, it is both ways, but it is a little narrow if you've never been down the Tunnel of Trees. So we are going to do that, and then the plan is to check into our hotel. We are staying at the Colonial Inn in Harbor Springs. My mom and I stayed there once before when we came with my aunt and friend, and we liked it, so we're going to stay back there and then explore Harbor Springs. And then tonight we are heading to Pond Hill Farm, which I'm really looking forward to. They have amazing beer i think they have wine too and lots of pumpkins and a lot of fall fun so we are going to head there later on so that is our plan for today so come along on this adventure my channel i love sharing all of my different adventures whether it is the country or to disney world one of our favorite spots to visit which we will be heading to in a couple of days so if you like that type of content be sure to like this video be sure to subscribe and also follow me on Instagram where I will be sharing live updates of our upcoming adventures. So let's go down the tunnel of trees. Driving along the Tunnel of Trees, you'll come across the Good Heart General Store. This is a must stop. It is super cute inside. I believe that they're famous for their chicken pot pies, but it's a super cute store. Definitely recommend stopping here. And when we stopped there, there was a little market to the right of the store. So we went and checked that out. And then we went inside the store and did a little shopping before continuing on and driving through the Tunnel of Trees.
we just got done driving through the tunnel of trees and the colors are beautiful. I am so glad that we added that to our trip. And we just got to Harbor Springs and we are checking into the Colonial Inn. So they are checking in and getting the keys to our room. And then we are going to bring in our luggage, freshen up a little bit. And then we are going to head to Pond Hill Farm, which I am so excited to go there this evening. I wonder how that. Got it? And I go check. This is my telephone. That's my telephone. Yeah. Fireplace. Oh, I need to watch my coin. Oh, look at this little area. It's a little coffee bar. I'm down here. Turn on the TV. I can turn on the TV and watch my coin. Okay, nice little sitting area. This is nice. If I can watch. After checking out our room at the Colonial Inn, we got settled in and then we headed to Pond Hill Farm. Pond Hill Farm is located in Harbor Springs. It's not too far from the Colonial Inn and they are all decked out for fall. They have so many different pumpkins. We visited with the animals. We explored the farm. There's so much to do for little ones. This is a great place to visit year round. They have lots to offer and we decided to have dinner here. We heard that their food was amazing and so we headed to the cafe for dinner. They also have a great selection of craft beer and wine and I decided to order the pumpkin beer and it was incredible. My parents got pizza and then I ordered the spicy peanut noodles that Franklin actually ended up eating most of. He really loved the noodles. He's going to share the pizza but he opted for my noodles instead. And then we just explored more of Pond Hill Farm. <laughs> After having an amazing time at Pond Hill Farm, we headed back to our room and we just relaxed by the fire and we watched some Halloween cartoons and had a really amazing day in Harbor Springs. When we got back, we had some of our leftover food and then we just kind of relaxed, watched a couple Disney Halloween shorts and then we went to bed. But around 3 o'clock, we all heard like this noise, like a drippy noise, like And we think it was the pilot on the furnace, and it kind of woke us up and kept us up for a while. So I am so tired, but we are going to head. They have um, complimentary breakfast here at the Colonial Inn, so we are going to head there for breakfast. And then we might stop at Tom's Mom's Cookies if it's open when we leave, and then we are going to hit the road. Colonial Inn offers complimentary continental breakfast. So we had it there for breakfast. We drove over from our building. Our building was a separate building from the main building. And the inside of the lobby was super cute. And then we headed to the breakfast area. <music> breakfast we headed to downtown Harbor Springs and we walked around and they had a bunch of different skeletons in front of each business.
What did you get? Yeah. A tootsie, tootsie roll. roll. Wow. <laughs> Don't stand on it. Turn around. Turn around. <laughs> Sit next to the skeleton, the chef. Hello. Then we headed to Tom's Mom Cookies when they opened up, and we got a couple of cookies for the road. Tom's Mom Cookies is definitely a must do when you are in Harbor Springs if you like cookies. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming along on this adventure and until our next adventure, bye!